Hello and welcome to the Watson Gallery, the weekly update uh, during the lockdown. Uh, we're now in week five of the lockdown, uh, which is, uh, as we all know, quite a long time. And uh, the aim of these very short videos is for us, as soon as you can't come to us, we're bringing the artwork to you. And what we're trying to do is uh, feature um, an artist a week or a couple of artists every week, uh, especially the most popular artists, um, just so that you can uh, get, a, get an insight into what's going on in the gallery right now. Behind me uh, is this week's um, focused artist, who is Peter Goodfellow. Peter Goodfellow is an incredible artist, truly an incredible artist. Uh, he originates uh, from the northeast of England. For many, many years, Peter um, was a top flight illustrator for all the big London agencies. Um, and after a number of years, after a great career of doing that, he decided, you know, probably 20 years ago to stop uh, illustrating and to do what his true uh, lifetime passion was, and that is painting. So him and his wife Jean moved to the Highlands, uh, where they live in the most amazing location, and indeed is the inspiration for everything he paints, which you will see behind me. Everything that he paints is... Uh, to do with Scotland, so the landscapes of Scotland. And as you'll see from this one, for example, you might, some of you might recognize it. That's with Buchel from uh, Glencoe. Uh, and there's other scenes from uh, different places around Scotland as well. He always writes on the back, everything is an actual location. So none of it's fabricated and made up. He writes on the back the actual location so that it's there for, for everybody to be reminded. And his work is just fantastic. He works with a colour palette of a, well, frankly, of a much younger artist uh, because the colours he uses are so vibrant. He also uses very, very bristly, big brush strokes, which creates all the detail, a lot of the detail, in the mountain ridges. And he's a very confident painter. So what he actually does is with these big brush strokes, these singular big brush strokes, he actually creates all of those ridges. Um, and the colours, because he mixes on the palette and then takes it to the canvas, what he does is he brings that, and as he's doing these brush strokes, he actually brings some of the under colours through at the same time. I mean, I'm trying to describe it because it's so dynamic in what he actually does. They're, they're just fantastic. I want to just show you, I don't know if this is going to work, I'm going to, going to try, but you'll see from this the sort of colours that we're talking about here and also the sort of brush stroke effect that he does. So as I said, again, I don't know if this is going to work. I hope it does. And you'll see the sort of colours, but also the brush strokes, the broad brush strokes that he's got uh, in the painting itself. And they are fantastic. We've got a, a, a number of pieces at the moment, which you can see on our website. And frankly, if you because we can't get out to the landscapes at the moment. Maybe now's the time to engage with us here at the Watson Gallery. You can go to our website, you can drop us an email, whichever is easiest for you, or, or give us a call. We do pick up our, our voicemails, and uh, we would love to hear from you. Um, we'll obviously look forward to seeing you when we are not in lockdown, but until then, we wish you well, we wish you to stay safe, and most of all, uh, enjoy your art.